Hey everybody, I'm out here in the car and it's raining outside, as you can see. <laughs> Big storm coming through California on the Pacific Coast. So, we're getting the tail end of it. It's like 58 degrees. I got a little rain hat on. <laughs> You know, I don't have a really a raincoat because it don't rain that often out here. I probably do have an umbrella in the house. But I'm going to run to the store to Smith's. I got to buy Christmas dinner. <laughs> I know. I'm kind of cutting it short here. But, you know, there's three of us and we have different tastes and, you know, different likes and we don't want to have a lot of leftovers, just a few for maybe a day or, you know, sandwiches or, you know, a meal and sandwiches. So, you know, I kept waiting to see what everybody wanted. And finally, we decided to have ham, some homemade scalloped potatoes or au gratte. <laughs> um, and I'm going to get some broccoli and cauliflower and I'm going to roast them. We head out into this rain, then me and my sister are going to go to the antique store and uh, hopefully everything will work out with this weather. Woo! Woo! All right, bye. Okay, prepping. A little cauliflower, some onions, Brussels sprouts. We're going to make homemade scalloped potatoes. So, get all my prep work out, out of the way. And, uh, and I'll do my din din later. Bye. Hey, everybody. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's December 27th, and uh, it's 48 degrees out. I just got out of the shower. Worst this hair. <laughs> I need another haircut. I'll put a little bit of this tea time on there. Can you see it? Tea time. So it's uh, black tea aged defiant all over syrup. That's what I need. <laughs> so you don't need much. Can you see that little piece right there? Oh. I usually concentrate on like a Z zone, you know, here and or T zone, I call it. I want to say Z. Because <laughs> to me, that's where I have the most issues. All right, I'm back. So, this is Aragon oil. And this stuff is great for your hair. Now, I don't put a lot, probably like, I don't know, maybe a dime amount. If my hair was longer, I would add a little more. But. Smells so good. I love this. <laughs> I'll let that sit in my hair for a little bit. Uh, okay. Now, put a little face cream on. And I got this. I get it at uh, Macy's Backstage. These are only like anywhere from four to five bucks. Well, this is, uh, oh, it feels so good on your face. <sighs> And your neck. Oh, Whew. looks pretty good. Feels good. Feels so good. <laughs> so, uh, let me set you down here a little bit, get you a little more straighter. Oh, like I said, I just got out of the shower, so I'm going to. Uh, I've got clothes to wash. I'm gonna throw all the little blankets from the front room in the washer now do some of my chores. I tried to make pancake, blueberry pancakes this morning. I don't know why my pan just was sticking. Everything was sticking. But I did get a couple pancakes to eat. So I had blueberry pancakes, some turkey bacon, and coffee. I'm going to put a little face on. Just, I'm not really going nowhere. But, so I'm going to go put some clothes in the wash. I have to get my mirror. My son was using it. He was trying to cut his own hair. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to you in a little bit. Bye. 
Okay guys, I'm going to make some northern white beans. I got one cup, that's all the beans I had. Uh, I got a little ham uh, and onions. I'm going to saute those a little bit. Uh, I got a bouillon cube, the chicken bouillon, I'm going to put in there and then we're going to have ham and bean soup later today. I got my pot on the stove. Let me go over there and saute my stuff. Saute these a little bit. Let me put you down here a minute. It's kind of hard to cook and uh, show you, but I'm going to I'll bust up this bouillon cube in here. I'm going to get my water in there. My beans. Alright. So I got my water in here. Got a cup. I'm talk about a cup of uh, chicken broth. Oh, oh I got to put a little salt in there. And I got about that much salt. I put about a tablespoon of salt in there. Gonna bring it to a boil, then I'll reduce it to simmer and cook it for about three hours. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. All right, guys, I just came from Smith's, getting a few things for New Year's. You know, today's December 30th, and last night we went out. My family friend, instead of buying us gifts, he took us all out to dinner. And it was really nice. It was uh, Italian. I can't even try to say the name. It was a uh, family style, so they put, like when you ordered, let's say, spaghetti and meatballs, they had a small or a large. And the large served five people, and the small three. So it's uh, where you order stuff and everybody shares it. We ordered quite a bit of food, but we all got some to take break home. But it was really good, and I didn't feel, it was kind of like being at a buffet. You, I mean, a potluck, you know, try a little bit of everything. And so it was, it was pretty good. I mean, so the flavors were there. We had pizza, spaghetti meatballs, chicken marcella. Top salad which has the ham and everything, olives in it, I forget what it's called. And then we had fettuccine with chicken. <laughs> so, uh, so it was quite a bit, but there was uh, two, four, six of us. So, you know, it wasn't too bad. But uh, that was nice. I haven't been out to dinner in a long time. Uh, or sit down restaurant, I should say. So that was really nice. I'm just going to do some chores and kind of, I did the table last night for New Year's. And we usually just stay home, but I have finger foods. Uh, I've got a couple of frozen pizzas. And I don't really cook dinner on New Year's Eve. We just kind of munch when we, you know, we're all adults. There's no little kids that we have to feed, so we eat what we want to eat. And, uh, but I got, uh, you know, little side things, popcorn and, you know, cheese dip or crackers. And if it's just me and my son, I don't know, my sister will probably come over for a little while. She usually comes over, has a cocktail, and then stays for a little bit, and then she leaves because we know New Year's Eve, there's a lot of crazy drivers out there. You don't want to be caught up in it, especially if you're going to have some cocktails. So that's what my plan is, kind of get the house together. And our friend that took us out to dinner, he'll probably stop by. Him and my son are going to uh, go out for a few cocktails uh, beforehand and then come, come back to the house. And then at midnight, I make uh, black eyed peas. I make some kind of green, and we eat that at midnight. I have I have ham to put in it, and that's kind of what I'm gonna do now. Just do my chores. I just got out of the shower. <laughs>
going to call my sister, see what she's up to, if she wants to do any running around or anything. Because <laughs> if not, I'm just sitting here at the house, you know. So, that's that. And I'll talk to you guys later on. Let you know how, I'll show you my decorations I did. I'll post them on here. Hey, Happy New Year's Eve. So, I got my beans on. I put on a little makeup. You know, got to be fancy, even though I'm at home. <laughs> got my black eyed peas on. Uh, made a little dip that's in the refrigerator. So, I'm just uh, going to have some pizzas tonight. Something simple, finger foods. It's nice out. Kind of overcast, but it feels good. <laughs> so, I'll be giving you an update as we count down for the New Year's. All right. Okay, my beans are done over there. Black eyed peas. Got a little bit of munchies. Got some uh, chocolate popcorn. A little bit of cookies and sweets. This is kettle corn with some crackers. I've got a dip in the refrigerator. And I got some seasoned nuts, some little Fritos. Nothing a whole lot. You know, just my sister's coming over and my little flower arrangement. <laughs> I like to put out the gold and stuff. And this is so we could take some pictures. And he put a four up there. It was 22. And there's my table. All decked out for... Oh, there's Santa over there in the corner. <laughs> and idiot. <laughs> so, yeah. We'll just sit here. And we'll have cocktails and... Let's try to bring in the new year. All right, I'll take talk to you guys later. Bye. My sister just left. She doesn't stay too long because you know there's crazy drivers out there. So I put my jammies on. I got my little Christmas socks on, and I had to put a t-shirt on because Mama is hot. Look at that, hot lights. Whoo, baby, count down. Okay, update. So it's 10 o'clock Pacific time. We just celebrated New Year's with my daughter in Nebraska. <laughs> so that was kind of cool. They just had theirs. There are people shooting fireworks, but while we wait for Pacific time, because next would be Mountain and then Pacific, we're going to play some Monopoly. Me, my son, with my daughter in Nebraska. That's pretty cool. So, all right. Just an update. <sighs> Got my jammies on now. So, okay, it's about 10 minutes till midnight. Heating up my, I made some cabbage. Sauteed in some butter and garlic. That's going to be our greens. And then I got some black eyed peas. A ham. Supposed to be for luck and money. <laughs> <laughs> Change of hair here. We got about 10 minutes. 11.54. And a whole new year. I survived another year. Oh my goodness. 2024. All right. We'll do a countdown in a little bit. Six minutes. Bye. There it is.